everybody, Gamer Penny here, bringing you another episode of our Lord of the Rings Online Let's Play. And we are back with Baird Beam, and today we're going to continue on a couple of these side quests. Um, patrol the road to Middle Need. Oh, up here. Okay. And what is this? Unfair trade? Search Urukai ambushers for stolen goods. Not that guy. Up that. Where's their ambushers? There's one straight up that way. There's one. Okay. Two. This horse stood back up. <laughs> okay. That. Um, I need more ambushers. And you, and you. We'll be done with that. Okay. That's all, right? Yes, now we can go back to the town. Do, 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 do. Your horses are there. Hello, horsey. Where's this guy? Right here. I hope we will find aid in time. There's that's the level I wanted. What have you done, Wildermore? Shadows lie along our Find path. and defeat as Gaja. Must seek to dispel them at all cost. Gaja? Okay. Straight this way. This looks like an orc camp here, huh? Don't. Thank you. 
Oh, there they are. Okay, defeated as Gaja. There, this should be the last two that we need um, to aid this town. And guys, guess what? It's becoming daytime. <laughs> I was complaining the last few episodes that, um, man, we only play this game for some reason. Every time I play this game, it's nighttime in the game. But it's four dawn. <laughs> we might, <laughs> we might see dawn. All right, Edric. There are not enough curses these? in the world for the invaders of the lands of war. The enemy must be punished for encroaching upon our lands. Invaders have wrought this misery upon us. There are not enough curses in the world for the invaders of the lands of Rohan. Okay. Rally Eggleman to your side. Where is that? What? Oh, hello. The white wizard has taken everything from us. He's the guy that was hiding in the outhouse, in the privy. Enough curses in the world for the invaders of the lands of Rohan. These lands were once so fair. Find a sword and find a shield. Here, this looks like a shield over here. Like a tire, a wheel, a wheel. There you go. Now a sword. Sword somewhere over here. I see some glowies. Whoa. <laughs> Sad thing to Finish watch now. your lands die. Right along the road south toward Eastfold. Okay. Help. Riding along the road south, right? Yep. Hey, you dick.
I missed what it said. We found a, a cart. Keep riding. Ugh. Keep riding south, I suppose. sign here and you're riding south old stag off to the side A farmhouse in the distance. Will you aid the horse lords? Vision is dire. How do you get up there? Here we go. Hey, you. Our mission is dire. I saw them pass in the last hour at a fairly slow pace. Should you ride swiftly, you will no doubt find them along the road. Okay. We'll continue this way then. Oh no! All those people we helped. Oh no. It's a sad thing to watch your lands die. Fairy people. That's sad. Uh, we just helped all these people. Probably convinced a few of them to come with this. You. I know you didn't do it, but... You're dead meat. Very Leo fled. Oh. The white wizard has taken everything from us. It's a sad thing to watch your lands die. Ready the horse at Pendlex Farm. Aid Engelman in returning to Entwade. The 
white wizard has taken everything from us. It is a sad thing to watch your lands die. Okay, so now we gotta get across the ford again and get back up there. Dang, that sucks. <laughs> That sucks. Not even reading the quest, just knowing like, yeah, we just helped all those people and that's their fate now. It is dawn. It's daylight. We can see. Man, we have to go back and tell the Thane that his wife and all his people are dead. <laughs> That's rough. Unless we get back and the Thane and all his people that stayed behind are dead too. <laughs> they wouldn't put it past this game. Like... This whole Rohan expansion is like, here are the worst stories that we could tell. Not not bad stories, but like the worst endings. Like the most heartbreaking things you could tell you you could tell. That's Rohan. So far, there's been no hope. Alright. White wizard has taken everything from us. The enemy must be punished for encroaching upon our lands. Hard negotiations. This In is the called. grim aftermath of the Wade Slot, Thane Adric journeys to Aderus to confront Eowyn on matters of honor and duty. There are not enough curses in the world for the invaders of the lands of Rohan. says, do you know what, why I brought you here? No. Baird Beam, you must bear witness to the terror that befell my people. Only then can they understand what I must do. Let us hasten to Medusalit. I tire of climbing these stairs at such a pace. Where is everyone? There are not enough curses in the world for the invaders of the lands of Rohan. Eowyn, is he mad at her? Stop your shouting. I assure you, you have my attention. There's no need for such theatrics outside the Hall of the King. Edric, what business brings you here at such an hour? 
I apologize for my outburst, but it is a serious matter, Eowyn. May we speak in private? I see. You two return to the hall. I know how long this... No, not how long this will be. Now, what is it you wish to speak of? Is he gonna attack her or something? My people were slain to the last, Eowyn. My wife fell with them, butchered alongside the rest. Edric, I am so sorry to hear such tidings. I've come to report that the Wade is lost. Though it stands yet, what reason remains to defend it? The war, our history, the Estern met. Do you not see what might still be lost? Edric, your grief has consumed you. I cannot help you, not like this. Nor did you before. You left us to die. Tell my, my people were not forgotten. Dare you speak that? I mourn for your people, Edric. Truly I do, but you cannot believe such things. The guilt lies with Theoden. I shall not forgive him simply for casting Wormton from his court. It was no fault of the king. The white hand are to blame, and you know this as well as I, Edric. Only through this inaction does their blood stain the fields of Rohan. And you. Yours shall be the blood that stains his hands. Whoa, Edric! What business have you with the Rohirrim? If he spoke true, I grieve for his wife and people. These are dark, dark times in Rohan, and it pains me to see our people's face with such brutality. I know not when this madness will leave him, but I shall speak of the good he and Leofled have done for our people, and she shall live on in our songs. I know not why he forced you to follow him here, but I am thankful that you fought alongside me. Jeez. Okay, I can't move. There we go. <laughs> Talk to Eowyn outside Medusalid. I have need of your aid. Thank you for your aid, Baird Beam. Edric's judgment was hindered greatly by his loss. I hope in time he will see the error of his ways. He'll be cared for here in Edoras, and when he is willing, I would see him return to his post should he wish it. He has lost enough. I would not die him, deny him this too, even in the wake of his fool's foolishness. As for the attack on Entwade, we must make ready to ride. I shall fight in his place. I have need of your aid. We're already filled up. <laughs> Um, dang it. What I really need is the bank. Alright, we're gonna go fight for Entwade. Seeking to avenge the wrongs done to her people, Eowyn rides east to drive the White Hand from the Wade once and for all. What business have you with the Rohirrim? Uh, without armor, you stand little chance against the White Hand. I mean you no offense, Lady Eowyn, but I shall not seek shelter. I would sooner die than allow the White Hand to claim Entwade. Especially after the horrors they visited upon our people. Your courage is admirable, ill-advised as it may be. I shall not deny you vengeance. I shall, sh shall seek it for all of them, but where is Thane Edric? 
He's an edoras, and there remains no time to speak of such things. Let us drive the white hand from the wade. Okay. Got a reputation up. I'll have to deal with that later. No, no, don't travel. Our mission is dire. Okay. Oh, defeat the ones attacking the Palisades. Okay. Lords. Okay, I'm not reading it. I'm just kind of going along with it because this is a side quest. So we're basically just defending, you know, following Aowen. As well as the others. Oh, I wonder if they'll scream as well as the others. Why don't we find out? They are, this is the group that killed the other ones. 
Hey. Oh. I didn't realize I was dying. Where's it going to put me? Unbelievable. We got to do that whole thing again. I didn't realize I was almost dead. I could have uh, not died there. Ugh. He put me all the way up there, huh? Unbelievable. <laughs> we don't die too often around here. I think what we'll do, since that's a side quest... Stop it. Ow. God dang. gonna juke this guy. Stop it. Can I not get over this fence? Stop. I can't believe it. The fence. Fence did me in. Alright, what I was trying to say... Can you really not hop this fence? Can't go into that field. Is that I would like to... Um, carry on with the main story quest. What level is it? 88. And we're 85. That's okay. Alright, can I get down there? These are desperate times Albert. for Rohiri. No, so what I'm gonna do is follow the road. I can't believe we just died twice in a row. And from here, I want to go this way. Are you guys mad that I didn't go back and do <laughs> do that quest? Oh, uh, we could have easily done it. I wasn't paying attention to my health. Uh, we could have easily gotten through it. I just... didn't want to do it again. Especially if it's just a side quest. A good side quest, but just a side quest. Okay, this is gonna go around Edoras. No, around, yeah, around Edoras. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum.
And we're just gonna have to follow this around. Oh, and these are the... Tombs. Instead of going into the city, go around this way. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum. Now we should be on the way down there. The entrance of Underharrow. Hmm. Fisherman over there. <laughs> He's like, I don't care what's going on. I'm just gonna fish on this dock. I feel like it's unsafe to go anywhere by yourself in Rohan right now. I mean, this is a beautiful ride. I would love riding out here for the clouds. But this is absolutely beautiful with all the waterfalls and... One's wagon. I feel like we should free this horse. Hey. We have arrived. Now we must find Ellen Fremadon. And hope that the tapestry of her the tapestry of her that Eowyn wove for us was an exaggeration. I must confess that her distaste for the woman strikes me as rather strange. By all accounts, Ellen Fremadon has never spoken against the good of Rohan and has been nothing but loyal to the kingdom and to her husband Dunhir. Indeed, she is a minstrel of no small skill herself. I heard her play the fiddle once at Aeoworth several years ago, and she made it sing in a way I've never heard before nor since. Still make no mistake, these are unwelcome tidings we bring. Even the most reasonable lady will not be pleased to hear the news that many scores of folk are seeking shelter in her hall. First things first, I want to come up here. Grab this. These are desperate times for the Rohirrim. Ha. Huh. Your tidings are over late, bringer of ill news. Ever since early this morn, ragged folk have been pouring into Under Harrow, bringing hungry mouths and sad tales. I will not close my gates to them, for the word of Theoden King is law, and done here my husband would be wroth were I to disobey the Lord of the Mark. I will do my duty, but Eowyn cannot expect me to be pleased about sheltering so many. You, perhaps, can provide some help to me in return for this hospitality. The blacksmith Ordwald is forging weapons and armor by his home to the south. Go to him and carry the heavy barrels of swords, armor, and spears back to me. 
Oh. <laughs> Little hobbit, hello. Okay. Ordwald's shop. Is it across the river there? All these little like villages have such cool out like out what are they? I wanna say outlines, but that's not what I meant. Layouts. They have such cool layouts. Um but I keep just thinking like, man, it would be really cool to live here, it'd be really cool to live there. This would be my house over here. Look at that on the distance there on the horizon. Like this one is in Rohan, but kind of in a woodsy area. Like, it's really nice. Bucket of swords. Pick up a barrel of armor. Just carrying all this stuff back and forth. It's fun, there's another player out here doing this stuff. Bum 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 bum. Pick up a barrel of spears. It's one step ahead of me. That's not how you should carry a big old bucket of spears like that, Baird Beam. That's how you throw out your back. Workplace ergonomics would have something to say about that. some spears I see the question in your eyes why have you toiled to bring these barrels here why does the sweat so sting your eyes what good has it done to carry these weapons and armor to me where they will stay the lady of Herodal's eyes are angry embers as she springs her trap it has done no good Baird beam by gift of birth Eowyn commands some little measure of respect and I give it to her but she has sent only trouble to Harrowdale do you see these swords and spears do you see this armor she has sent to me townsfolk and children, the aged and the infirm. She has sent no warriors. She has sent no one to wield the bright blade or brandish the sharp spear. These folk will die just as easily here as at Edoras. There's no purpose to this migration. 
My husband falls and those who ride with the king are defeated. There is no safety in all of Rohan. This is the cause of my reproach, Beam. Eowyn plays at war as she always has, but there are women in Rohan who truly know what is at stake. I am one of these. Enough words. I've spoken plainly and I have nothing more to say. Okay. What do these look like? Do they look cool? Ooh. They all look the same. That looks cool. Up the horn at the entrance of the underharrow. Alright, let's go tell Horn that she's pissed. <laughs> she's not she's not happy and she uh, made her point and now I'm sore for it. I did not think to find Ellen Fremadon so cold. No we one should aid her if we can. Well oh, sorry, I just found a bug on myself. I'm <laughs> creeped out now. Yuck. Okay. <laughs> I did not think to find Ellen Fremadon so cold, Barry Bean. No one save the forces of Saruman are to blame for the unenviable un situation in which we find ourselves. But I understand her frustration. We should aid her if we can. I spoke with some of the folk in Underharrow while you were recovering equipment from the blacksmith, and they told me a group of orcs and wargs have threatened the peace of Dunharrow. The townsfolk have been used to these foes lurking in the mountains, but of late they have journeyed too near to the towns for comfort. Dealing with these creatures will allow us to send two messages, one no less important than the other. The first will serve as warning to the orcs that Harrowdale is not theirs for the taking. The second message is for Ellen Fremadon, telling her that she does not stand alone. Her worries are ours, and she need not give up the hope of survival. Let us defeat the orcs and wargs in Harrowdale, ba Baird Beam, collecting tokens from each so we may send these two messages. I also wish to see the dark door of Dunharrow. I will meet you near it. For only few would speak of it, and then only in whispers. It fills me with curiosity. Okay, we will do that, but we will do that in the next episode. So guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up here. And when we come back, we'll continue on the main story quest. So I want to thank you all so much for all of your support on this series. If you do want to see more of the Lord of the Rings Online Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. Alright, bye-bye everyone.